Hello YouTube. Oh, looks like we can't we don't even tell or not. We had our first frost of the season. And that's why I brought these uh plants inside the apartment because there they are right here. So we gotta go through the dead uh plants, uh pick up the dead plants and revive the live ones. We can do that sometime today too. Oh, you wanna say hello too? Hello YouTube. Okay, uh all right, I'll our channel took a little hit last uh, couple weeks, uh, which I'm not surprised because every cha every channel got hit hard. Uh, come on, people, let's be smarter than that on on out here on the internet. I had people quitting Facebook because their uh, attacks on them. It's an election process. We go through this. I I have not seen it this bad uh, at any time. I mean, it's been. Well, I think since what or the early seventies during Nixon years, I think it was. It I was don't bad. Know. I don't know, but uh, I don't remember the Nixon years. You were not even born during the Nixon years. I was only a little teeny little. You know, I was only maybe barely knee high at the time. Oh, come on, people, let's be smart out out there, okay? Uh, let's stop the hate and uh, let's just start a. Let's move on to our lives. It's only an election. Um, it's not going to change. It's only going to change in certain policies. And there's something called the Bill of Rights. Uh, for you, some of your uneducated people, please look it up and read it because that is your document that protects your rights. So just remember that. Of course, I'll probably lose more subscribers because they don't believe in it. But I believe in it. Uh, that that Bill of Rights is your document. Your your rights ain't going to go away. So stop crying. And stop crying. Uh, let's move on, okay? Uh, right now, we got, I gotta get going because I forgot something at Walmart. Yeah, and you we gotta wanna... get going. You gotta get stuff put up on the patio for Christmas. Oh, yeah, because yeah, because I gotta straighten out the mess downstairs that were caused by uh, I guess people running three uh, washers at the same time. I don't know how they can run three washers at the same time when one of them's been out of order for months. Yeah, how's that for a storage bin, Angie? I like it. Yeah. See what it's American made too. Uh at Walmart. Who ever thunk that? I was busy when you were gone. You were busy or gone? I got my uh app set up. Oh you got your app set up? Mm -hmm. On your phone? Oh, you did the dishes. I got it from away. Yep. And that so Yeah, we got some goodies in here. We're gonna take this downstairs. And we gotta clean up that mess downstairs in our other storage box where we have our Christmas lights. Yep, that's what else, that's what else we bought. Last night, uh, when I was cooking the, uh, uh, when I was cooking on that grill last night, I kind of touched the, uh, side of the oh, grill where it was fingers. hot. What? How's your fingers? It's okay. It's not, there's no blisters on them. You don't know if you can see them. There's no blisters on them. But yeah, we had no run with... The garbage uh, dumpster diver there. Uh, there was a guy there. It was in dark last night, so he couldn't see him. But he, Angie, when well, Angie, he worked all the bags, ripped open all the bags, right? Yeah. And yeah, so I don't know what he hauled out because uh, we were busy eating our supper, and I'm done with it. I don't know. I thought we were done with the dumpster diver. I thought we did too, but it's a different one. It's a different one this time, so. Yeah, the other one is, I heard he's not doing so well. Next time I don't touch the sides right in, right here. That's why I touch, that's why I burnt myself. That's why I fried my fingers. Yeah, we're doing laundry. Yep. I'll time you join me. Yep. Okay. We're killing two birds with one stone because we got to clean out our storage bed because we've been having some water damage in our storage bed. Uh, that's why our last vacation when we took, we had to throw away sleeping bags and air mattresses. We had to get a new air mattress, but we didn't ever bother to replace our sleeping bags because we didn't really need them. No. Now we wish we did because it was cold that trip, remember? It was cold that trip, right? Yeah. Yeah, it was cold those nights, so wish we would have had a sleeping bag. So right now, we're going to do our laundry and we're going to clean out that storage bin that we have. Somebody stored their bicycle in this pen, but he lives in a building. Uh, he should be using those over there instead. Should be using number five over here instead, which it's right down there at the end. But I guess the reason he's using this 
it's easy to get his bike in and out of here, I bet you. And yeah, so we should tell him that. Yeah, I want you to tell him. Yeah, he's gonna scream and howl at me. Well, he's gonna find out the hard way, right? When someone needs it. Right now, we gotta clean out our pen. Hey, we locked it. We're picking lock. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, we gotta straighten out that box. I think we're okay back there. So I'll show you what what I did back there. But yeah, we gotta clean all this out. Uh, let's get to it right now, right, Angie? Let's do this. See, I for, we're getting a lot of water damage in here because people was running their. Uh, I don't know where the water damage is coming from. I'm thinking, moving. Excuse me, Angie. I'm thinking because people was running their washing machines. Uh, you gotta run one one at a time, and I think one of these is bringing a leak. I don't know if it's this machine or the machine I'm currently using right now. It's that one. Uh, the one is out there, is down there with the stuff that I have on. That's been out of order for months, and of course we're over here, and we're paying with water damage here. That explains why we don't have stuff no more. Yeah, we're going to have to start making insurance claims, Angie, if we're going to document stuff down here. Right now, we got to go through that box. That's going to be a train wreck. See, this is why I told Angie, she wanted to throw this part away on me. I told her not to do it. Oh, more spikes. Yeah, I'll get those spikes out of there. But this is exactly why I told her not to throw out that box. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hold your horses. Hold your horses. Slow down. Let me explain, okay? Hey, but I didn't want to get stuck with a spike gun. No, on the don't back. worry. Don't worry about it, okay? I won't hurt myself this time like I did last night. But I'll just explain why I had this box, why I left this box in here. Because if I didn't have that box in here, oh my God. I would have had that water damage, and that water damage would have been on our inflatables, and an inflatables would have been no good. True. True. So I was thinking ahead long before we. You did by leaving that box inside the thing. But yeah, we can use those spikes because if we lose those spikes in our tent, we can use those metal spikes in for our tent purposes. But you know, I gotta make sure they are dry. So Angie, don't put them in the thing until they're dry. Okay, we'll leave them sit on top. So they dry, then we'll put them in the thing, okay? Okay. But right now, that's our water damage we have to deal with. Right now, we don't have to worry about it because we're in a tote now. We're moving into a tote. Of course, if anybody remembers our camping trip, this is our that's extra clothes I have to go through. But right here is our cooler. This bag has our tent inside. That's our airbag right here underneath right there that's our airbag and there's our water pump you notice how I got it set up and elevated just avoid from getting the wetness I'm using these old Christmas lights as a because uh, we don't use these no more and they're no good uh, because why because it's wet water everywhere it's coming from the uh... so now we're good to go we'll see we've got room in there remember that's a snap-on lid now Angie I know. So we'll get this thrown away and we'll take care of that, right? Yes. But that's basically what we're going to do because I got to get something elevated to keep this dry somehow and we're going to find something way better. So I got to do some measurements in here and see what we're going to do and elevate everything out of there. But that is a total mess. And then we're not the only one suffering it. So whoever's got this locker, that locker is okay, but whoever's got this locker is going to have the same problem I have because it's seeping underneath there. It's a mess in there, is it? Yeah, yes. that box was worse than I thought because I think it had some black mold on it. Uh oh, that's not good. Yeah, so that's what I'm worried about. Uh, I don't know. I'm hoping. Uh, he's like talking to the management here is like talking to a wall almost at times. And it's just like, it's almost like, if anybody's talking to the management, and every time I try, we, report something like this it's just like talking to the wall almost oh yeah we'll get to it we'll work with it and all that stuff uh like i said uh luckily we should have done this years ago right we should have done this years ago as yes just to be on the safe side and i want to have this issue now because oh man it's a mess 
right now with everything being elevated that should hopefully drive as like I said I'm using those old candy cane lights uh, to elevate whatever I'm going to put on it so this way it help stays dry hopefully it will yeah better because I'm checking on this quite often Angie said it's more organized it's more organized the washer right now is gurgitating like it's burping and we got it elevated somewhat uh, about that much off the ground at least if as long as those uh, candy cane holds so we're gonna I'm gonna invest into something to elevate like plywood and all that stuff to get someone elevated would that work? That would work. So we've got to get it measured but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna worry about it I think we're good to go right here everything's all elevated especially our tent bag our sleeping bag especially that's one we need to worry about the most and our Christmas stuff is in a container. We're good. I might invest in another container for the tent and that just to be a precaution in the future. So we'll look at that. That would work. That would work too. It gives us more organized space. Yes. So this way we can get new sleeping bags. That would work. Yeah, we'll invest in sleeping bags in the future. But right now, let's just lock things up here and just get it over with here. And that. So let's just close it all up. Lock it up, Angie. Give me the keys, lock it up. There we go. Look, look at all that water. Yeah, look at the water right there. Watery mess. Well, yep. Angie wants grilled cheese sandwiches, so we got these ready to go. We're gonna about ready to wrap up the vlog here. I gotta make sure I don't burn myself on this. Well, see, that's how we make our grilled cheese without butter. Take one of these uh, pantini sandwich toasters, and that's how we make our grilled cheese. All right, let's check these little beauties. Yeah, oh man, those looks yummy. Yes, we call it grilled cheese, but I'm also call it toasted cheese because it's daily it's toasted, but it's grilled on our little pantene maker. But right now I gotta make two more. Uh, two for Angie, two for me. Angie's busy on the computer, and we'll let her, her close out after she eats this wonderful lunch I prepped her up with. Fish is doing okay. And I think we're doing okay, because until that storage thing gets fixed, uh, actually, I'm hoping that thing works out really well. So uh, I don't want to, I don't want to end up losing any more items uh, down there, because we can't afford it. Uh, technically, so we we never did replace the sleeping bags. We did replace the uh, air the air mattress, and good thing we didn't really replace the tent. That would have been the most expensive part to replace. And that we can run that tent according to what I saw when we put that tent up. I could probably get about two to three more uses out of it, or what we call two or three seasons out of it. So I think we'll be okay on that area. I'll see if there's another tent on sale. When it goes on sale, I'll grab it, right, Angie? When another yes. tent goes on sale? Yep. You want a six man tent or an eight man tent? It uh, depends what we can afford. Yeah, listen to the ladies. Whatever we can afford. Angie, it's that time. We're gonna close out the show anyway. We gotta fix the storage bin down there eventually in a few days. By the way, my grilled cheese sandwiches were delicious. Yay. And please like, share, subscribe. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. -bye.